So because we're there for seven weeks, we can, we can spend the time, and that's another thing that's unique about our field school, we're, we, we spend time in four different places. We're, we're in Rome for about, for about three weeks. We're not in any one of the four places we stay for, for, for less than a week. Mm. And, and because of that, you can, you can get into a neighborhood and you can use the same cafe every day. And, and those kinds of rituals, I think, are, are super important. And, um, you know, it, it ends up that by the end of the, the field school, the, the students have layered all of these experiences on top of them uh, on top of uh, e each other so that they, they come away, I think, really profoundly changed in most cases. Yeah, it's a really deep, deep feeling. Yeah. yeah. There, was, there was something that I remember that you said in Rome, sort of at the end of, of when we were in Rome, that was uh, something along the lines of being from a city is not the amount of time that you spend there, but mm. more on what you give and put into the city. And yeah, it was something that uh, the architect Massimiliano Fuxas said to us this year that that uh, he's he's a Roman. I mean, actually, in, yeah. in our interview, I yeah. I yeah, said right something right. to him. We were asking him questions about being an Italian architect, and he wasn't really relating to the question. And then I said, "But you're a Roman," and mm -hmm. he very clearly was like, "That I am. Yeah. I am. A, I am a Roman." But then he made it very clear that he has this. Um, uh, there, there's a, the background history of his family, and that, that you know, there's all these different nationalities that they that they ended up in in Rome, and, and it's not that long ago. And this notion that you know, you sometimes read that you know, there are people in Rome who can trace back uh, their history, you know, twelve and fifteen generations, and they they sometimes um, call these people the Romana di Roma, you know, the, the most Roman. Um, but I think that, that what Fuxas said was that, um, you know, another way of thinking about that was that, uh, you know, after you spend more than a week in Rome and you start using the same cafe every, every day, you suddenly are a Roman because there are constantly people coming into this city and that has been the history of that place for thousands of years. Mm -hmm. And it, it's such an amazing place because it's an unbroken history. Mm -hmm.